always dreaming about you Hi everyone, Petal is Bless here. I'm coming on today to share with you guys two ideas I have to make um, these little two little decorative vases that I'd like to make and I'd like to come on and share that with you guys. And I have, um, I think it's a little candle holder. It's in green and I want to spray paint that white because I don't like the green color it's, it's in. I found it at a thrift shop that I went to. So let's see how I do these DIYs with you guys today. All right, everyone. Let's get started! <laughs> this is the green candle holder I got at the thrift store. It's very nice. I like the details, so I'm going to spray paint it white. And here's a tall vase from Dollarama. And this is one from Dollar Tree. And we have our blinged out gems from Dollarama. And we have some tape to tape off the vase and we're going to spray them. And we have our scissors and our glue gun. And we have our white spray that I got from Walmart. I'm just using the tape and we're taping off the areas that we don't want spray painted. Just putting the tape all around. Here's our two vase all spray painted and dried and this is the paint I used from Walmart. Now we're going to use the bling and bling out our vases you guys. Okay I'm going to be placing the gems everywhere the clear crystal is showing on the vases. I'll be placing large stones and then small ones, large ones and small ones all the way around till we get to the top. Now for a second vase, I'll be only using the small gems, placing them all around where the clear crystal is. here we go you guys our decorative vases and I like how the um, little white can green little green candle holder turned out once I spray painted it white <laughs> it's very nice I like the detail that shows through I just love how it looks and I knew it would look super cute in white and it does and our decorative vase look very nice with the spray paint white going around and then the crystal gems to fill in the spaces I think they look very nice the small one with the small gems, which is very nice. Remember, you can achieve this look with the gems from Walmart. The small gems, and then the large one with the large and the small gems. I think they look so cute. And here's another way that you can show them 
with the flowers inside. I think it looks very nice. And you can also place the flowers in the tall and in the short vase. I like how they look with the flowers. That's how I'm going to display them. With the flowers inside because I think it looks very nice. And with these flowers, I cut the stems short and I put some little round foam balls. I just stuck them in there as you can see here. And the reason I did this is because you could see through the vase so I didn't want the stems showing down right through the vase so I cut them short and put them in the foam ball and this one I also put in the foam ball just to give it some stability that's why I added the foam balls because they're short and here's where I place them on my TV stand like I told you guys I wanted two nice decorative vase to go beside my TV <laughs> so this is where I place them <laughs> Alright everyone, I hope once again I've inspired with a lovely decor for your home <laughs> for you guys to do. And thank you for coming on and seeing the DIY that I did for today. And remember as always you guys, stay blessed from Petal is Blessed. <laughs> bye bye everyone. Ooh, yeah, yeah.